Hi there. It's been a long time. Let's talk about the changes I made to my 1v1 map. I've added some cool new things to the game. For example, I've added new weapons, new consumables including chili chugs and slurp mushrooms, and I've also added something you might be interested in. It's a box fight arena. Now you might be thinking, why would it be a 1v1 map if there was also a box fight arena? Well, some people prefer to do 1v1 through box fights, so I decided to make an area for that type of thing just to make it as fun as possible if people would rather do that instead of the normal 1v1 area, which is right over here in the center of the map. I also want to show you what I've added to the play area real quick. I've added, I've added paint canisters, and I've replaced the stink bombs with smoke bombs. And you're probably wondering, why did I did, why did I do that? Well, the stink fish already do the same thing as the stink bombs, so I decided to replace those with smoke bombs instead. I also added shadow bombs and balloons, but I already think you know what those do. I've also made a unique change to the game that was suggested by a friend of mine. I'm not sure if you're going to remember this, but you remember this large tunnel that I've had in here? It was so large because I wanted people to have a lot more room to move in. But my friend Wesley said that it looked kind of annoying, which after a while I kind of realized that, so I decided to shrink it a little and make the tunnel a lot more thinner than what it used to be. So now the tunnel looks a lot more thinner and less big. I know it's still a bit long, but it was a good suggestion. So you're probably going to ask me, what's going to happen with the rest of the tunnel? Well that's going to be used as a background decoration for now. And by the way, if your friend is a troll and plays this map, I've added a little security measure to the game. When you start the game mode, it's going to count down to three, and it's going to show some text but just to make sure they don't break anything that I placed, I decided to make the metal material indestructible so that, that way no one can break through simply and just walk over to the area just like that. Because I don't want anyone destroy be to be able to destroy anything that I placed in order to make this map. I want my 1v1 map to be as different from others as possible, or, I, or else I just may as well rename it to copied 1v1 with good weapons and heals. There is also no siphon in this because of the heals part, so don't request for siphon at all. I hope you're happy with the changes I made, but... I'm not ready to release it to the public yet. But still, thank you for all the support. And thank you for following the development of 1v1 with good weapons and heals.